And we're back to learning Premiere Pro and this time I'm going to show you how to create a blur vignette for your videos. You can find this clip via the description link below. The first thing that we need is an adjustment layer. Let me delete this one and I'll create a new one. Right click in your projects menu, new item. Select adjustment layer. You can adjust the size here but by default it has the same size as the sequence. So we can keep it, press ok. Drag and drop it in your timeline and then resize it so that it has the same duration as your video clip. Now we need a blur effect. Just go to the effects menu and type in blur. You've got many to choose from. I'll just pick a Gaussian blur, but you can try out the other ones as well. The process is the same. Drag and drop it on the adjustment layer and now we have it in effect controls. By the way, if you can't find these menus, go to window, effects and effect controls. We can increase the blurriness and that blurs the entire clip. You can see that in the preview window. And we want to mask it and we want to have a typical ellipse vignette. So let me use this circle ellipse tool and then I'll reposition the anchor points. Right now it's the inside that's blurred and we want to have the outside so we have to invert it. And we've got this box to check. For now we've got very rough edges or very hard edges, you can see that. So we're going to increase the feathering. Let me activate the mask and you can see what's happening. There is this dashed line and that signals the feather. So that smoothens out the edges a little bit. You can go very high, around 200 should be fine in this case. There's one additional problem, it's the edges. If we check repeat edge pixels, that problem is solved as well. So it cleans up the edges of the frame, you could say. And that's about it. This is the process of how you can create such a blur vignette in Premiere Pro. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.